And I did once read a Harvard Business Review article which accords with the improv mindset. Humble optimism. Optimism, I think it's gonna be okay. I don't know, but I think it's gonna be. But humble is I'm humble enough to know I don't know the future. And improv is I'm humble enough to know whatever you do is good and I want to make it better. And because that's iterative, we're both thinking it to each other. We create scenes and stories. We're listening to what she's saying. She's listening to what I'm saying. We're trying to move the story forward. So basically, listen to the offer, accept the offer, and give one to move things forward. I had a brainwave yesterday after all these years, because people think I'm talking about thinking on your feet. And I thought, I'm not actually. I'm talking about listening on your feet. Whatever I was thinking before, I've got to work with what you give me. And I know you're doing the same with me. That process is perhaps radical, because you might think most of our education is got to get to the right answer. There is only one answer. I can't copy, I can't share. And then you get to the real world, and it's, there's a bunch of answers that may or may not be right. You don't know, because they actually things change, and you're collaborating with people all the time. So exams are all about convergent thinking, getting to the one right answer. And there are times when you've got to be divergent. Well, actually, is that even the right question? And that's I dare say is what decisions about is when do we actually go for that when do we go for that